Welcome back to Dell EMC World 2017. I am Jeremy Brazel, JB, here on the pavilion floor as day one is in full effect. And let us welcome to the chair for this conversation uh, the man whose name I've said over and over again as we welcome you to Dell EMC World, <laughs> Michael Dell. Michael, how are you doing? Great to be with you. Thank you. Uh, it's an absolute delight. I, I mean, I simply have to say for this Monday, for day one of Dell EMC World, this version of it here in Vegas, what's the experience been like for you personally? It's been fantastic. You know, we've got a record number of customer participants from around the world. And to see all the things that we've been able to accomplish since the complete, completion of the combination, you know, a little over eight months ago with all the new products that David Gould and the team talked about earlier today, the reaction from customers and partners has been very strong. And, you know, I'd say one of the big surprises for me is that we haven't had a lot of surprises, all and, right. and things have gone <laughs> things have gone quite well. So it's all good. Well, you do have a pretty excellent technology team in place to make sure things go well. So that's an exciting part. Yeah, the team does make all of the difference. You know, it's it's been amazing for me coming and being a part of now the Dell family. It's amazing how natural the integration and transition has been. But you mentioned you've been talking to customers, and maybe elaborate more on the feedback that you've been seeing from our customer base as you speak to them? Yeah, I would say a couple of things. First is all of our customers are in one form or another on this journey of digital transformation. And many of them, quite frankly, are confused. They don't really know exactly what sure. does it mean, how to get there, they're just at the beginning of it. So that's pretty pervasive. And they're looking for us to help them, right, <laughs> in, in, in that journey. The second thing I would say is that the theory that we had that customers would want to do more with one company as opposed to multiple companies right. absolutely playing itself out in the marketplace mm -hmm. right? sure. in terms of the you know engagement the the winning <laughs> that's going on with our customers that's all going extremely well and i think the 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 way the teams have been integrated you know uh, is also gone gone quite well so I'm quite happy with with our our uh, our, our start. Right, uh, <laughs> these are these are the the uh, first couple of couple of uh, quarters of of the new Dell technologies. Also, the collaboration and cooperation across the strategically aligned businesses with VMware, with Pivotal, uh, with SecureWorks, with RSA, with VirtuStream. We're seeing that work extremely well, also, and so you know, quite happy with how it's all come together. And it's awesome that we're taking such a huge idea of digital transformation, workplace transformation, security transformation, and making it tangible and digestible for our customers, because it is overwhelming. They have an abundance of options, and the simplification of all of the combined Dell, Dell Technologies organizations is probably a breath of fresh air than what they're used to. So I'd say we're differentiated in that sense, but maybe speak more about how you think we're differentiated in the industry as it comes to our peers or competitors. I, I think across our industry, nobody has the breadth of capability that we have in digital transformation, IT transformation, work for, workforce transformation, and security. And as you get into the digital transformation, it's not really an IT project. It's, no, a, it's, not. it's an evolve your company project. It's right at the strategic complex of how a business evolves, so it really becomes something that's on the CEO's agenda, on the board agenda. In fact, it can't really be IT right. driven. It has to You're be right. from the strategy of the company itself. And that you know, obviously makes us more relevant, it puts requirements on us in terms of being able to deliver, but I'm, I'm absolutely seeing that level of engagement. So when, when we go and meet the, our customers, it's increasingly the CEO, the line of business leaders, uh, you know, the CFO, not just the IT organization. Right, it's, Absolutely. it's an important part to ultimately get them to the outcome they want and they need. It has to be sort of a, a belief more than just the idea of an IT uh, pro that says we need some new hardware. I mean, this is a, a, a transitional period as you talk about digital transformation, but Dell EMC and Dell Technologies is driving that transformation and by bringing it all together in one cohesive spot, it's just so powerful for everybody. So that builds into a lot of the outcomes you want to get to, which led to a lot of the news that's going to be coming out over the next three days. I'd like to know from you, what were you most excited about to reveal though? I mean, we've already put some good news out already, but what was it for you that was like, this is what I'm really looking forward to saying here in 2017? 
so many to choose from. I know. You know this would be like, like to put which, your, which of your children do yeah. you love the most? Yeah. Which you do. <laughs> you have one or more that you love the most. It's true. Questions. Let's put that myth yeah. to rest. No. <laughs> what, what I'm really excited to see is that we have made real the combined innovations. Right. When you look again at what David was showing on stage, and we're going to go into much more detail over the next few days, what we've done across Isilon and ECS mm. and all of our storage platforms and data domain, and our 14th generation servers, this idea of developer ready infrastructure, the integration of Pivotal <laughs> and NSX, the you know, collaboration going on between Boomi and Pivotal, uh, how SecureWorks and RSA are working together and what's going on with NSX with network segmentation, what you can do with security there. The, kind of amping up of our full solutions capability across the whole family is really unparalleled. And yeah. there again, I think, I think uh, we're highly differentiated. Absolutely. Very cool, so this, this conference, if I can bring it back to our customers, because we are announcing a very innovative technology, just a, it's a testament to, to the lifeblood of our organization being that of a technology one for our customers. What would you like them to take away from these next three days? If, you're sitting back in three days getting feedback from a customer, what would you like to hear? Well, there's a lot to take in, right? And, and so uh, I, I, hope, I hope they'll take time to learn about all the capabilities we have. We also want to take time to listen and hear feedback. And you know, we'll have thousands, tens of thousands of individual meetings with customers as we work with them to apply these solutions you know, to their specific business challenges. Uh, so look, I, I, think, I think for all of our customers, there's a much broader set of capabilities than, than we had before. Uh, we want to make those real and bring them to life for all of our customers. Uh, it is the realization of it. Obviously, we see it everywhere. Realize is a big is the theme, and, and making the digital transformation real and helping those customers get there. But I think you touched on the one point that in this massive endeavor philosophically made it all work, which is that it was customer driven, that it was that, that side first and not tech or our solution is the solution. We're going to listen as much as we talk. And I, I think that comes from, I mean, your philosophy throughout your career in that way. And is it exciting to see this many people come under that umbrella and say, I think I agree with you on that point. You know, I, I, I'm sure there are other ways to do it, but, but you know, we, we, we've always liked this idea of design the company from the customer back. And right. again, you go and talk to the customers and say, hey, what are you trying to do? What challenges, opportunities do you have? And then you look at all the tremendous evolution of the ingredients of technology. Our job is to find the intersection point between those two mm -hmm. to help solve those problems and advance forward uh, you know, the, the, the customer's agenda. And as you are both talking, I mean, this, this conference will also serve to strengthen the trust our customers having us, being here, hearing from you, hearing from our other executives. If there was any question that this is all about them, that trust is strengthened and secured as a result of what they get to experience here. So that's, that's as you guys are talking, trust keeps ringing in my head as a critical, it, it's why customers continue to come to buy from Delhi MC. So. Well, look, you know, what, what we do ultimately matters a great deal. Right. <laughs> when, when, when I go around to our, uh, meet with our customers, I'm always struck at how important the work that we do is right. in helping enable their businesses. And we have a big responsibility Absolutely. to carry forward, not only in terms of the innovations and the technology and the development, but in the service and support and keeping all those systems running because you know, they're 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 running the world, right? And, and so You're they're, absolutely they're, right. They're, they're they're depending on us. <laughs> well, on that point, I think we've covered it that we run the world from here. And so, if you're here, uh, enjoy that. Michael, I want to thank you so much for taking time of your day. I know you're incredibly busy. Uh, thank you for having all of us here. I would say that personally for myself and for everyone I can speak for. Uh, an exciting time here at Dell EMC World. Uh, we're going to take a short break, but there's much much more coming back. Many conversations to dive deeper into what building the customer, uh, building a business from customer back looks like and much more on the content side after this.